Hi guys! I have approximately two weeks until we leave this apartment and to be honest, I haven't done much in this room. So, we will see how this video goes. It's not going to be everything in one day. I don't really have a plan of how I'm going to put all of this together, but if you are watching it, somehow I did. So, today I'm starting with the fabrics. I guess I'm going to bring all the fabrics here, I'm going to put them on the table, separate them into summer fabrics and more uh, winter and fall fabrics. The thing is guys, the thing is, we are not moving to our final destination, as I said, for those who watch the video knows or I don't know if I even mentioned it but probably I did. So we are first three months staying in a temporary place then we are moving to another temporary place and we will be searching for a house to buy. Uh, hopefully we can make this process as short as possible however the reality is that it will take few months. So we are basically not taking our entire apartment with us at least for first three months and to be honest it can be longer we will see depend on the situation that we are going to be in i already told my husband that i am going to take probably 80 to 90 percent of my sewing stuff with me i don't want to stop filming for you guys and i guess you also don't want me to stop filming for you so let's bring all the fabrics and let's start to organize i guess I've been seeking for the glory, say, say, say my name And I've been trying to write my own story in the search for fame I'm sitting here in this empty room, walls keep tumbling down, down Cause I ain't got nobody, I always feel so lonely when the day is through I'm in the spotlight, not on to midnight. I want somebody to hold my hand. Cause I got my head in the clouds, but I'm getting really scared of heights. I used to spend time with all my friends, but who's gonna like me if I'm up there? Cause I got my head in the clouds, but I'm getting really scared of heights. I try to get everyone to see me I play, play, play my games But I just end up looking like a showcase I have in myself to blame I'm sitting here in this empty room First thing I realized, I have a couple of uh, remaining fabrics that are quite small pieces. I would just go quickly through all of this and put all of them in a smaller bin like this. Uh, another thing I want to say, why am I placing all the fabrics in the in this specific bins? Because the place where we are going to stay is small. I am not bringing any pieces of furniture, that means also a story. My fabrics are going to be with me, but they are going to live in these boxes. At least they are transparent so I can see what is inside. Cause I got my head in the clouds But I'm getting really scared of heights Ooh, ooh, I'm getting really scared of heights Ooh, ooh Now, all of these fabrics here are just simple quilting cotton which I most probably I'm not going to need and use. I can say uh, immediately that these ones I'm going to pack in a box for the moving company. I'm in the spotlight, not until midnight. I want somebody to hold my hand. Cause I got my head in the clouds, but I'm getting really scared of so. Let's do the first bin. Uh, here I'm going to put all my viscose type of fabric for summer. Very colorful ones. I mean, it's middle of August, so I am probably not going to need them very soon. So let's just uh, collect all of them and put them in here. So, these 
are all the boxes that I'm taking with me. I'm still hesitating about the summer one. Uh, all the rest I'm taking. And uh, of course, there is one box here on the floor. This one, can you see here? This box is definitely not coming with me. I don't really need them. Now, let's continue, I guess. Hi guys, so it's another day uh, and today is the last day, everything has to be packed. I'm trying to avoid to take the things out of the drawers, so I'm just simply taping over them and I'm hoping that nothing will get uh, broken or lost. As you saw, all the fabric is in the plastic containers. I also just packed uh, all the things for the knitting. Uh, I packed my serger already. Uh, the next thing, I just have to pack the patterns. All the patterns that are in the envelopes, it's really just close it, put it in the box and tape over it. But I then have a pattern that are rolled and uh, to be honest I have to look at them and uh, just make quick and drastic decisions uh, which ones I'm going to take and which ones I'm going to just you know, throw away in the recycle. Uh, what else? Yeah, I think uh, that's it. Most of the things are done. Uh, also, as you know, I have two tables, but I'm going to take only one with me. And even this, I'm not quite sure if I will have a space to put it there, but we will see, we will figure it out, but definitely not two of them. I also have to pack my uh, dress form. I will not talk through this process because I have to be fast. And when I'm talking, I'm very slow. So let's do it.
So guys, we are here on the floor in the bedroom, me and Finn, my husband uh, left to throw some stuff for recycling, you know, and um, I don't know how this video will come up, if it will even go uh, online because I feel it, it was just so chaotic and not interesting at all in my opinion. But uh, if nothing else, then I film the trip. Uh, but I wanted to share my feelings about this moving. I think it was the biggest I have ever done until now. And I realized that we humans, we carry so many things around that we considered like completely, totally necessary for our life. And I think that they are not. And it's starting to stressing me out, of course, especially now when we are moving, to realize how much I'm depending on many, many things. And also, you know, this is a sewing channel. So, of course, when it comes to sewing, uh, let me just close the window. Wait, Venus. Wait. No. Of course. <laughs> Of course, now uh, while we are moving, it's even more obvious, but I don't know, I just don't want to depend on so many things in my life, so many material things. And when it comes to sewing, of course, I was saying, because this is a sewing channel, of course, I was packing my clothes and I have, to be honest, I have so many. I wasn't really using them and wearing them so much this couple of years, you know, uh, but <laughs> if you want to know the brand of the cookies, here they are. Be careful, your dog will go crazy. You are not allowed to eat this. It's not for you. No. 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 <laughs> no. And um, I was picking all my stuff, uh, everything, um, of course, uh, me made stuff. And I really want to, what, wherever I will uh, end up uh, living and whatever will happen in this coming months, I just want to be really careful what I'm sewing, of course. Uh, let's just be realistic and definitely I will make from time to time some crowd pleaser, if you know what I mean. Something not really necessary, but something that everyone enjoys the most but if I thought that I was being careful of what I'm sewing these days I would be even more careful this is what I wanted to share as, as a, something that I realized and something that so quite surprisingly brought me a lot of anxiety during this uh, packing uh, process today is our last day here, last night and tomorrow we give keys uh, to the people who will rent this apartment from us. We will stop by to see our friends and at the end we will end up in Netherlands, which I'm really excited for, even though I don't look like right now. I am, I'm just too tired to be honest. I hope that you are not disappointed that I haven't been posting so much, but uh, I guess that there is a reason to all of that. So, again, I hope you are all doing well and see you soon. Say goodbye to them. <laughs> Bye, guys. <laughs>